Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your iPod Touch 2nd generation and your iPod Touch 1st generation, iPhone 1st and 2nd gen. These are all untethered except for the iTouch 3G and the iPhone 3G. Alright, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak with Black Rain. Simple program. Alright, I'm going to set that aside for now. Alright, well first of all, you're going to take your iPod and you're going to plug it up to the computer. I'm not going to plug mine up right now because I just don't want to. Alright, so here's what you do. Go to the internet. Go up to the search bar and type in www.blackrain.com but with the I, you type a one. There we go. When you come up, you should get that dude. And then this does work for Windows and Mac. Click Windows. Save. Save to your desktop. Alright, once that's finished, take it out. Alright, now double click it to see if it opens. If it doesn't, and it says that your qtcf.tll is missing, this is what you do. You go to my computer, go to C drive, go to, uh, where is it, program files, and go to QuickTime. All right. Then look for the qtcf.dll and then copy and paste it to your desktop. And you should get this. Yeah. Now, just to make it go into Black Rain, just drag Black Rain over qtcf or drag and drop qtcf over Black Rain. Alright, once you do that, run the software. Right, look how simple that is. One button. Make it rain. Once you click it, it'll be about man, 20 seconds. And it will go, sh it'll show up like, it'll show up an iTunes symbol on your iPod. And then it'll show this like, guy with like shaggy hair and iPods going around him. And then it'll show the loading bar at the bottom. But if that keeps going on forever, this is what you do. Take your iPod, hold the power button and the home button for 20 seconds and it will reboot itself. Once it does that, rerun the, rerun the jailbreak and it should work. But that pretty much works it all out. And if that doesn't work, take your black rain file, go to my computer, open up your C drive, and put, up, put it in the C drive. And it should work. And then run it as administrator. Alright. And when you're done, it won't look like mine, but you can download stuff. I got a Vista theme. And it does unlock it. It's untethered. And I think that's it. Alright. See you guys, and happy jailbreaking.